Big old problems and major repair needs aside, some buyers are taking a chance on the now vacant Dolphin Tower condos in downtown Sarasota. It helps that it's Bayfront property and as SNN local news reporter Grant Boxliner found out, low prices don't hurt. Lena, it's been two years since Dolphin Towers experienced those concrete problems that forced everyone out of the building. And while those properties have plummeted in value, they're starting to sell again and you may be able to find a deal. Condo units at Dolphin Tower have been steadily dropping in value since concrete problems forced residents to leave in 2010. The biggest thing was the uncertainty. You know, nobody knew what was going to happen. Is the building going to be demolished? Is it going to be fixed? With repairs now set to be made, owners and buyers will likely have to pay $100,000 for assessment and maintenance fees on top of the sale price. Sandra Gardner is a realtor at Coldwell Banker. The owners, of course, are frustrated because it's been a long time. Some of them want to move on. So they're selling. REMAX Alliance Broker Associate Larry Brostek recently made a Dolphin short sale. He says most of the units there are listing between 50 and 80,000. These units are not selling for 350 and 400 now, but if you look anywhere here along Gulfstream Avenue, if you wanted to buy one today, uh, you're not going to be able to get much below the 300,000 range. You're still going to be into a unit in Sarasota, downtown, on Gulfstream Avenue, walking distance to everything. It's a great deal. And an investment that some believe is worth the risk. Total of 150, and you've got a downtown condo, two bedroom. Great view because it's a high level, it's the 12th floor. It has to be worth at least 200, so you've made 50 grand. It's a no-brainer. And no repairs have begun here yet at Dolphin Towers, but some of the owners are being told they could be ready to move in by the end of 2013. Reporting in Sarasota, Grant Boxleitner, SNN Local News. Already in 2012, 17 Dolphin Tower units have been sold. That's on pace to top the 20 that changed hands last year.